done. And here is Helen. Good morning to you. Good morning. So is one of our models who just stepped down from the runway there, wearing a lovely blazer with a pinstripe <laughs> in it. You're very on trend. <laughs> this is very, very old. So. <laughs> is it? Yeah. still working very well. Yeah, nice. it all comes around rather quickly, doesn't it? I know. Yeah. So we get to a certain age and we just go back into the wardrobe yeah, and find what's Yeah, that's right. I think sense. that's far more. How was Miss Marple? Um, Miss Marple was really good fun. Yeah. Julia, good fun? Yes, lovely, yeah. lovely lady. Yeah. Um, Why does she fit that role? Well, I, I haven't seen the whole thing actually, Have so I, 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 I don't know her exact portrayal. But she's, um, she seems to be very gentle and kind, and be able to kind of wean information out of people just by seeming incredibly not, not, not threatening in any way. You know? yes. So, um, nice and yes, calm. yeah. And yeah. who do you play? Um, I play uh, the housekeeper Mary Dove. Uh, she's, um, I think, I think she was described as enigmatic. I didn't really uh, know how to play enigmatic, but I did my best. <laughs> really? And um, uh, no, I really enjoyed playing her. She's sort of. And how um, did you play her? How did you approach it? I mean, the script may have said enigmatic, mm. but you talk to the director. You've got so much experience. Yeah. You know. Presumably, well, when you see a character, well, how these, you want to these approach. parts are all quite interesting because they're all um, uh, red herrings as well. So you kind of have to, you can you can play it a bit as if as if you're the murderer or as if you aren't the murderer. Oh, I shouldn't say I'm a red herring and I could be the murderer. <laughs> I've completely given it away. Well, you said you could be oh, absolutely dear. anything. Uh, yeah, I could. Um, yeah. Um, Anyway, so uh, I, uh, whoops. You haven't at all. <laughs> it is a minefield, though, and we do these interviews. We have to make sure we ah! never give the twist away. Um, anyway, um, there, there no are twist, plenty George. of other characters who could be the <laughs> <laughs> um, However... <laughs> right. However, um, yes, I enjoy that aspect because... Um, you can really, you can really, it, there are lots of choices, you know. Yeah, and it works for you, doesn't it, very well with your family situation mm. to do a one-off bang yeah, like this. perfect, and yes. Out again, because how old are they, how old are uh, the kids? I've got, I've got three uh, young children. Hands are full uh, then, I yeah. bet. Well, yeah, ten, seven and three, so, um, wow. yeah. But, yes, it, uh, things like that are, are perfect, you know, yeah. you go away and it's a bit like having a, a creative, exciting ten, holiday. Ten, <laughs> seven and three, do they go back this week? Uh, yes, yeah, they've, they've gone back. Thank goodness, in a way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we've had a really <laughs> great holiday, really, actually. Really but, good um, summer, but yeah. time to go yeah. back. Yes, yeah. I think they were ready to go yeah. back more than me, You don't really. know what to do with them after a while, do you? Because actually, well. didn't you sacrifice y your career for them in a way? Could you have stayed in America a little bit more? Well, I think, I think, it, I think okay. all women do. I think, yeah. I think um, you know, you, you're always, as a woman, um, considering that highly the most important part of your life mm. and um, and I know I don't think I've I don't think I've sacrificed anything I've I've make it, made choices mm. that make me happy and hopefully my family happy there's always and a I, demand. I love both there's well, always a demand isn't there to be ambitious career-wise I think do you think well, things I are am, changing? I am I am uh, and always have been I feel ambitious but yeah. I was am, I'm ambitious for my whole life you know mm. every I, part of it yeah there, there are many different aspects obviously we, we've been talking a, about a service, excuse me, um, about um, swag this morning. Sassy, wise and grown up. There's new research, Helen, that comes out with women between the age of 35 and 45. It doesn't sound as bad as it is. Are, you, are you happier <laughs> at, in that age group between 35 and 45 than you were in your 20s? And most women overwhelmingly said say yes. absolutely because they know more. Are you one of them? <sighs> no, I think, I think the older I get, the less I realise I know. Oh. So maybe that's wisdom. I don't know. Maybe wisdom is knowing that you don't know anything. Oh, that's um, true, isn't it? Uh, but I'd say yes. I'm. I. I have a. I'm content. Mm. I've, uh, and getting, know, getting getting older is is has is good and bad, isn't it? And knowing so. what roles to take. And this was a good one for you. You've enjoyed this yeah, one. Yeah. No, I've really enjoyed this. Yeah. I. I. I it's set in the 1950s, so I got to wear a, wear a costume. Uh, yeah, a proper 1950s hairdo and. Yes, it's Mary fun. Dove in Miss Marple. Yes. Looking forward to it. I wonder what happens in the plot. <laughs> Thanks. <Helen. laughs> Thanks very much. It's lovely to see you. Thank you. <laughs> On a Friday, don't ignore him as well. Don't yeah. <laughs> Please, everyone else does. Helen, thank you. Now, still to come.